Okay, welcome to Mother Talk again. For last some days I have been uploading different uh, kinds of videos. If you haven't watched so far those videos, please subscribe it, share it, and uh, comment it. Okay. So today in front of you with uh, another good uh, lesson that is a lantern as big as a house. Okay, a lantern as big as a house. Okay. So lantern means light. Without the light, the light is not so possible. as before okay so a lantern as big as a house so two things are there. first one is lantern second one is house okay so we do not like to live in darkness everybody needs what light lantern light candles the okay? lamp okay so food shelter water clothing Food, shelter, water, clothing. These are the necessary basic needs of a person. Without the food, we cannot live. We cannot. Without the shelter, we cannot live. Without the water, we cannot live. Without the clothing, we cannot live. These are our problems. Okay, now we are discussing what a a big house, a landed house, landed plus big house. Okay, you know the largest house in Kerala, which is the largest house in Kerala. Arakal Palace, which is situated in Wayanad, uh, who is the owner of Ashok Kumar. I think uh, over forty thousand square feet. Uh, I think uh, over forty thousand square feet. Uh, the another biggest house in India, what a uh, Mukesh Ambani's, uh, uh, Angela House, um, Mukesh Ambani's, uh, Angela House. For lakh square feet, and the biggest of so, all, it is the dream of a person making a good, beautiful, luxurious, and convenient, comfortable house. This is the dream of a person. Okay, so a lantern as big as a house. Okay, see, so it is the dream of a person making a good house. Okay, so now we are going to. Present before you, before you, the festival of Vesa. Onna you know, Vishu you know, Bakri you know, Eid ul Fitr you know, Christmas you know, Pongala you know. These are all celebrations. These are all celebrations. Okay. So now we are going to discuss another celebration that is Vesa. I think that nowadays uh, celebration means you are happy. Onna, Bakri, Eid ul Fitr. Like that celebration is you are happy. I am happy. You are not school. Do not need to come to school. Teachers are not giving homework. Full time sitting with the uh, father family and sharing your experiences with the friends. But in the school with the books, with the notebooks, with the teachers, with the benches, like that only. So that is why in celebration time you are happy. Okay. So this is special celebration. Especially it is celebrated in Tibet and Sri Lanka also. Okay. Now we are going to share such a such an experience of a boy and his grandmother. So the festival of Vesa, giving honor, it is a honor giving process to Buddha. Okay, we celebrate the birthday of Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Then we celebrate the birthday of uh, uh, Gandhi Mahatma Gandhi uh, on October second. So this celebration is made for giving honor to. Him. Buddha, Buddha. Okay, this celebration is given giving honor to Buddha. Okay, see people are in this day. People are going to temples, temples. You know, Shabari Mala temples in Kerala, Sri Padmanabha uh, Swami temples in uh, Kerala. Then and you know, Satya Sai Baba temples, the temples. Then you know the another what time? Uh, Kashi Shinada temples, Kashi Shinada temples. You know that, yeah. Okay, like that. The temples are there. People are going there, and they they give their prayer to God. So people are afraid of God. It is the obligation of each people. What is that? They are going and giving prayer to God and getting consolation. Okay. So it is their daily pa daily routine. Going to temples like that. Okay, so during the Vesak day, the people go to temples and giving their prayer also. See, and the jingling dances everywhere. 
Okay, yeah. on the way to the temple and you on the lanes, roadside, everywhere people can see what they people can see what they different kinds of different kinds of lanterns, light. Lanterns and light they can see there. See tingling, it is tingling. What is tingling? Glimmering. It is scintillating, shining. Okay, it will be very beautiful. Okay, during the Christmas celebration, you can see colorful, mm, colorful water, colorful stars. We can see colorful stars. Isn't it uh, beautiful? Yes, really beautiful. Okay, so tingling lanterns everywhere. And party, yeah. What is a person in this chapter? Party. Huh? Family all together worked for making a big land. Now the, the, the family is going to make a good house. They want to make a good house and they want to arrange some lanterns. Without the lantern, this process will not be beautiful. And everybody in this village, in this city will be going to make a, a big, big lanterns and big, big houses. So that is why for this purpose only they will, they will make some houses. Okay, so Patya and his granny, grandmother also decided to make what? Another big house. And this is their desire. This is their wish. Making a good lantern and it will give some happiness to them. So it is a great respect to God Buddha. So this is their belief. So now they are going to make a supreme house. Now they are going to make a supreme house. Nowadays our family, our uh, father may be abroad and uh, who has been continuously working Gulf without seeing mothers, without seeing family, children. They are continuously for Long years they have been working in abroad for what? For the family, for constructing, for constructing house, for buying, uh, maybe uh, for buying clothes for you, for giving food for you. Like that, your father and uh, some elders, brothers, they are working abroad for what? For the family. So they are doing their great work. They are doing their great hard work. It cannot be expressed in the words cannot be expressed in the words so you are valuable words supporting words your uh, memories everything required they are working there for the family not for the happiness of their own they are working for family okay see so now we are not in the dark age okay we are work we are living in the world of light see tingling lanterns everywhere Patya also decided to make a good house with the family sitting together they are working together all together they are working all in all process a whole process they are all working together okay it is, it is they are going to give a devotion to god okay going to make the god happy huh? without making the god happy the life will not be happy so firstly making god happy so this is their intention this is their aim making the god happy see another point no money this is a poor family okay this is a poor family nowadays celebrations are going on everywhere according to their family status according to their uh, wealth according to their economic level people are doing what uh, different celebrations are being made in this country maybe highly costly dresses they are using okay delicious different varieties of foods they are using together different uh, foods maybe biryani mandi chicken roast then what uh, like that like that dress like that like that foods they are using why according to their own family status it is a moment of pride and proud for some families so they are making their their own food for what uh, to impress others not for not only for eating it is for impressing others okay so but this family has no money it is a big celebration all the people in sri lanka are celebrating this bazaar okay so no money so grandmother told we can pick sweet potatoes sweet potatoes we can pick nowadays we are purchasing it from the market okay some sweet potatoes are there in our house yeah. we can dig it we can dig it using a spade 
and uh, we can take it out and we can sell it and you will get money we can also celebrate like this granny consoled the boy don't worry my boy we will also make a lantern and we will also celebrate with the family this is the good words given by the grandmother to Parthia okay see granny inside and great so now they 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 purchased some kinds of bamboo trees okay and they purchased some kinds of papers and they are also making a an artificial house they are also going to make a artificial house and light okay so granny is the supreme commander of this program and granny first who is working granny is working first who is working first granny is working first so granny is overall leader she is the leader and she is doing the work okay see granny got inside so firstly after constructing the bamboo trees in different shapes like a house na she is making it like a house and she got inside the tree and she is working inside of the tree and pasting different colorful papers in the surrounding of the bamboo the surrounding of the bamboo what is making what is pasting there what is pasting there different papers colorful papers and making it what as a as a house okay and decorating Decor she is decorating yeah without the decoration the other people will not watch it yeah so decoration is needed so she is beautifully presenting with the decoration okay so gandhi is there and some papers are there some charts are there some colors are there she is using such kinds of materials to make it beautiful so by posting cutting and trimming okay she, there, there is a scissor in her hand and she is cutting it uh, there are different multi color papers are there she is pasting those pap papers and pasting it okay okay now she is very happy she is very happy who is very happy who is very happy granny is very happy party is also happy what i already decided what this time we have no vesag celebration why cash but granny told no problem cash is there cash is there okay we can also make a glimmering light we can also make a skid lighting light we can also honor the buddha we can also venerate buddha no problem okay we will also make another another shelter here we will also make another shelter here and we can also provide great honor to buddha we can also respect to buddha we can also exhibit our our own things before others and everybody will come here and everybody will watch here and we can also be happy and we will also enjoy this program who said the grandmother to boom to party okay see i have matches to light and she used one match box okay we can use this match box and we can light it we can light it and i will enter into the house and i will light a candle and during the night time what will happen then the light will come there and it will attract the people so what will attract the light the candle light will attract the people and uh, there will appear a shadow there will appear a shadow there will appear a shadow shadow police you know shadow police are there without uniform they are watching the people observing the people and the common people cannot identify the identify the shadow police but they will they will notice the mistakes and they will take and go those people if they make make, make mistakes so shadow police without uniform they are coming if they come by uniform what will happen you let the fire and the people will be all right they cannot find out so such a team is known as shadow police see so this is what not shadow police this is a they are going to make a shadow inside the house and granny is standing inside the house and the candle is light there then what will happen during the night time the paper house will be 
glimmering the paper house will be shining the paper house will be scintillating then what will happen there will be a beauty there will be a beauty people can enjoy it everybody will enjoy it it will be totally an extraordinary one eh? so far they didn't watch such kinds of lantern anywhere so in our small house we will make a an extraordinary one and the people will come here people will be happy so we will also be happy and we can give great respect to lord buddha they decide so so we can see what an aged woman in deep meditation in prayer so motion pictures they can see the still pictures they can see the air and it should a woman sitting the in meditation so it will totally give an extra ordinary sight for the people so patya you be happy i am your grandmother i will show you this is my great aim who said that who said that grandmother okay understand it see and i am sure it will be the grandest of all the supreme one supreme god you know like that no other light can be seen is as beautiful as ours so i am sure it will be so beautiful which will be so beautiful our light our house our big house with the lantern will be beautiful who said the grandmother okay and this of all granny tore and stepped out and like that what happened in the days came the day came and the people watched the lantern made by the grandmother and patya they really enjoyed they really surprised you. who is there who is the woman standing inside the house they really surprised it is a night time it is a night time they could not find out they could not find out who this woman was really surprised and the party became very happy so what are the grandest of all granny go and step out the land as big as house and like the wish of our boy he made a big house with the support of grandmother okay so what is the message means we want to say we want to spend our time with old people also old people are being neglected nowadays no consideration for old people they are sent to some houses we need to give the respect to the old people we want to live with the old people we want to support them there is no other person other than us so we how to give our support to those people for whom for old people okay and we want to protect all our celebrations uh, whether it is hindu celebration muslim celebration christian celebration parsi celebration whoever it may be that is not the problem we are living in a democratic country here there is no separation all are equal huh? saying consideration will be given for all so we too should give such kind of tendency it should have in our own mind so keep in mind for that only we are getting good education through good education only it is possible when somebody for forgets all the, those things what happen you should remind them don't behave like this don't insult others don't give dishonor to others okay my dear children keep all this point be happy and uh, once again i remind you to subscribe mother talk for more videos like this thank you thank you thank you